many years ago along the Illinois Wisconsin border there was this Indian tribe they found two babies in the woods white babies one of them was named Elizabeth and she was the fairer of the two a while the smaller and more fragile one was named Marie Having never seen white girls before and living on the two lakes known as the Twin Lakes, they named the larger and more beautiful lake, Lake Elizabeth. And thus, the smaller lake that was hidden from the highway became known forever as Lake Marie. We were standing Standing by a peaceful white Standing by a peaceful white Oh, ah, oh, ah, oh Oh, ah, oh, ah, oh Many years ago I found myself talking to this girl who was standing there with her back turned to Lake Marie. The wind was blowing, especially through her hair. There was four Italian sausages cooking on the outdoor grill. <laughs> Man, it was sizzling. Many years later, we found ourselves up in Canada trying to see about marriage and perhaps catch a few fish. Whatever came first. That night she fell asleep in my arms, humming the tune to uh, Louis Louie. Oh, baby. We gotta go now. We were standing, standing by a peaceful white, standing by a peaceful white. dogs were barking as the cars were parking. The loon sharks were shocking and the knocks were knocking. Practically everyone was there in the parking lot by the forest preserve. The police had found two bodies in the woods. Nay, naked bodies. And their faces had been horribly disfigured by some kind of sharp object saw it on the news, you know, in a black and white video. You know what blood looks like in black and white, don't you? Shadows. Shadows. That's what it looks like. All the love we shared between her and me, that is. Man, it was slammed. Slammed up against the banks of old Lake Marie. Lake Marie. Who's standing? Standing that peaceful water. Standing that
Jack, 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 Jack.